The city of Edmonton has been constructing tunnels for the last 100 years or so. We are digging a hand tunnel 30 meters below ground. As we were about halfway through the day, we started noticing some interesting shaped rocks and looked down a little closer and there were dinosaur bones. I'm still, like, have to pinch myself. I think I might be dreaming or something like that. We got a call Friday morning saying that uh, the city uh, digging a tunnel had come across bones. We're three hours from Edmonton, so uh, what we did was get in touch with somebody at the University of Alberta, uh, uh, track down a student of paleontology who was able to come over right away. And so I came down here and I was surprised to see what they had already taken out. Uh, they took out the a large end of a femur. And when I came down in the tunnel here, I actually saw that the rest of the femur was still sticking out of the rock. Yeah, they were they were pretty excited about it because they have never they've never had a chance like to come down like this. Well, usually when we're digging out something, it's at the surface or very close to the surface. So never have I dug for dinosaur bones 100 feet underground before. The men were saying, "Yes, uh, uh, we found something very significant." Uh, uh, it could be very big. What's significant is, is their occurrence. I mean, what, what's being found in what context with what other animals? We have a big adult duckbill and the other a baby one. And the third one was a meat-eating uh, Albertosaurus. The paleontologists are estimating around uh, 72 million years old. Uh, it was a really great experience uh, just being able to pick them up and handle them. Not too many people get to do that. Yeah, we're going to continue digging and uh, the paleontologist is going to be on site with us when we get to that layer. And We'll have somebody down here uh, while we are finding the bones and as soon as the bones stop, then our job is done. The paleontology of the province is really very rich. Uh, you know, you think of Drumheller and Dinosaur Park, but there's, there's fossil material all over the province. But for the crew as well, I can feel the excitement. Yeah, it's a sensation hard to explain really to hold a bone in your hand. You think it's a once in a lifetime uh, event? I've talked to guys and uh, none of them have ever found anything as interesting really as, as what we've been finding here today. 28 years in the in the you know, career, this is the first time uh, I've been involved in anything like that. It's, it's a pretty cool feeling.